it's very uh, important uh, for for our for our thinking at raw material that we don't use art or we don't work with art as a illustrative system of whatever is going on politically, but rather the contrary. We work with art and artists that are in themselves, in their practice, embed a thinking system that is political or that addresses polit politics. So that's very important to the to to uh, to uh, uh, differentiate because, and this is also one of the reasons that I have a little bit of issues with certain social practices issues, artists, artistic practices because uh, it's the 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 line is very thin to become a kind of a list illustration of uh, you know i think an art organization like raw material company is not an editorial room so an exhibition is not a newspaper either so i, I think uh, artists and certain artists and those that actually those we are interested in and we've been working with over the past few years are, are people that have in themselves created their own universes that have a response and have embedded in it political concerns, social concerns, and so on, and not in an illustrative way, but really in a, in a deconstructed, so even subversive uh, ways that are challenging to, uh, to the society. So uh, that said, as an art organization, you, and especially in the context and the territories and the environment that I work with, you cannot not be uh, hands-on because you wake up in the morning, you open your door, you're faced with issues. You cannot look away. You know, you cannot pretend they are not there. They are just there. So you have to find a way to not necessarily solve them and respond to them, but to engage with them and live with them in a way that makes your work relevant to whatever is surrounding you.